<laughs> oh my freaking god, there is a bee in a beehive right ah! <laughs> Oh my god, that's scary, scary, holy crap. I am allergic to bees, if you did not know that, I hate every kind of certain bug. I watched Bugs Life and I had nightmares for 10 years. Actually, not really, I'm just making a joke right there. Hey, what's up guys, welcome to Super Electro Beast, and you're watching day 52 of my Super Electro Beast everyday vlogs. I'm so happy that I'm actually vlogging outside on the back side of my porch. I don't think I have done that in like seriously two weeks, and it feels so great that I'm still able to be outside without it snowing without the rain coming in without any crappy weather I think it's technically fall right now because we got all the fall leaves and everything like that look at that yellowness yellowness this was like the summer the summer leaves and then it's like summer fall <laughs> and then the weather's I guess it's not super bad it's like beautiful like clouds it's like Simpsons clouds almost actually not really Simpsons clouds because Simpsons clouds is kind of like animated and everything and I don't think life is really that animated why the heck is this here it's okay question of the day um have you ever naturally no this is not gonna be the question of the day I'm just gonna say something like kind of seems relatable to you guys because I always seem to like doing that. Anyways, I just noticed this and uh, I've probably never noticed that in my whole life. I just noticed that we just got this thing and it kind of just pops out of nowhere. Just boom! There we go. Transportation from the 1800s. That seems kind of weird. Today, I guess I'm just going to vlog today. Just do whatever I want. I'm going to vlog like every day. Oh my god! I'm so pumped though that I'm at past day 50. I know it was two days ago since I was past day 50, but... Ah, okay, that felt weird. I got like this kind of phlegm. That's disgusting. Oh, by the way, I went to school and they said that there's this like Chinese tradition or not tradition, but there's this Chinese fact that if you have a lot of phlegm in your throat or something, that means that you're uh, that you're gonna have good luck today. So yeah, I think I'm gonna have some good luck because that was very disgusting fact that I went and told you guys. <laughs> Oh my god, this is awesome! Look at it, it's StarCraft and the computer. Guess what, Lang? Did you realize that I'm vlogging again? <laughs> I'm about to play some StarCraft and I'm actually not gonna really show you the match. It's just, I just, that, this looks so cool! Oh my god, getting this for, for free. I feel like I'm just stealing from the government. Oh yeah, and I totally forgot. This is something kind of stupid about me. If you guys play StarCraft, which I mean, you go online, you go to YouTube, so I mean, I'm about to find one guy or one girl that goes and plays StarCraft. Do not play it on your freaking laptop because then it will play one frame per second. <laughs> Oh my god. Guess who lost at StarCraft like five times in a row? This guy. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so terrible at StarCraft. Don't worry, I'm not going to be addicted to it, so I'll be able to edit videos for you guys, and it will be entertaining. Maybe not this video as much, because I haven't really done that much recording-wise and everything like that, because it's all dark out and everything. Anyways, talking about games, I want to show you this thing. Now, you're probably like, did you really do this? Yes, I went to Airbrush, and I went and, I guess, Airbrush the comrades of Castle Crashers. If you know what Castle Crashers is, you are a saint and you are awesome. Castle Crashers is basically an arcade game made for Xbox Live. And these are the little companions that help you on the way. I freaking airbrushed them because um I could. And I was a sophomore. And then everyone was just like, oh, like you like making little cute animals. And I'm like, you know what? Yeah, I kind of forgot to vlog today. It is the night right now, and I have only recorded like a minute and a half of footage and everything. Like, what's going on? I just, I guess I don't feel like vlogging right now. I mean, like, I've already been vlogging for 50 days and everything like that, but I should not complain. Don't complain, Angus. I'm not going to complain. Okay, <laughs> what am I talking about? Um, anyways, yeah, I went to Famous Dave's for dinner. Did I already say that? I'm not really sure about that. But anyways, yeah, I went to Famous Dave's, and it was actually kind of awkward because I actually had friends that were working there, and we had like the most brief conversation because I was there with my family and everything we're gonna have like a family dinner and we we're just gonna have like a family moment and then like it was just kind of weird because we I always like locked eye with all my friends that were actually like working at famous days which brings me to the point of the question of the day today what makes you kind of feel immature or what kind of situation in your life had made you just feel super immature I guess that kind of made me feel immature since I've never really had a job before I mean that's why I need a job in YouTube YouTube jobs would be awesome by the way the partner program I uh talked to you guys saying that I uh, applied like about a month ago I still haven't gotten an uh, answer yet saying yes or no or not which is kind of weird so uh, I guess my application for my YouTube partnership has been I guess processing for about a month which is kind of weird I mean I, I rather have them just say no and so I actually know that I should just go and get better I mean no matter what for YouTube videos I'm gonna just no matter what just always try to get better but uh that was the question of the day what just makes you feel a little bit immature actually I also want to tell you another story that made me feel really immature this 
one moment that just, oh my god, it seriously branded me of embarrassment. I felt so freaking embarrassed. Okay, so this took place in my middle school. Middle school times, I was just a little tyke. I was wearing my capris and everything like that. And I was just a regular kid with an IQ of 20. Anyways, we had this parent-teacher, I guess, conference and everything. And where all the parents get into the assembly room or whatever. And then one, one by one, a teacher goes and talks to the parents. Saying their, uh, I guess, their schedule, what they say and what they do in the class and everything. So the parents don't think that the teachers are pedophiles. Stop talking about pedophiles, Angus. I had to go with my mom and my dad to the assembly. And I was just like, Mom, no other kid is going to go to the assembly and everything like that. But then they're like, you have to go anyways because you can't get babysit because we cannot trust you alone. And I'm like, you got me there. I, I know I can't be alone while being trusted. That just doesn't work together. <laughs> anyways, I, so I had to go to the assembly with my parents to the, yeah, the parent teacher assembly. And the twist thing about that is that I previously had karate class. So I was looking like this at my middle school while all the other teachers, I mean, I was actually embarrassed by teachers, which was kind of weird. Like they were just looking at me and I was wearing my karate uniform at school and I was just trying to act off like I was super, super cool and everything. I was like, yeah, I'm like Chuck Norris at Jackie Chan this. Jackie, what the frick did I just say? That was just a pretty embarrassing moment where I just felt really immature. Honestly, I wish I could have just cut my neck off and been like, yep, I'm dead. So you can't really bring me to the assembly. My whole white lapel is just full of blood. Okay, I'm going a little bit too much in detail in that, but uh, that was the question of the day that I want you guys to answer. Not about, I, I guess, just say whatever you want. The question of the day, just say something that just makes you feel really immature or immature. By the way, do you hate some people? Like, I, I know it's like, especially old people or whatever. They say immature, not immature. I mean, like, you're supposed to say immature. They say immature. It's like, I hate you. Flick off them and then they go and explode. Okay. Yeah. You want to hear a ghost story? Actually, you can't really because uh, this is Super Electro Beast and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Why did I do that? This feels like the sun on my face. Okay, whatever. See you guys tomorrow.